After years of speculation, whispers, and theories, the James Webb Space Telescope has finally provided us with something that could forever alter our understanding of the cosmos, the very first clear image of Betelgeuse. The star, which many believed was on the brink of an explosion, has been captured in stunning detail. What Webb has uncovered exceeds all expectations. So, are we witnessing a never-before-seen cosmic phenomenon, or is Betelgeuse concealing something even more remarkable? Betelgeuse, one of the most mysterious and enormous stars in 33 seconds the sky, has always intrigued both scientists and enthusiasts alike. Its immense luminosity and size, 1,400 times the sun's diameter, have driven astronomers for centuries to study it with both suspicion and anticipation. This colossal red star, a supergiant located in the Orion constellation, has captivated imaginations for generations. But in recent times, something unusual began to unfold. Betelgeuse's brightness began to diminish, leading many to believe it was nearing the end of its life, potentially exploding as a 1 minute and 10 seconds supernova. A few years ago, astronomers made a surprising discovery. Betelgeuse began to lose its brilliance rapidly. For a star that shines so intensely, this behavior triggered a wave of concern and conjecture. Was it dying? Were we about to witness a supernova within our own galaxy? The excitement reached unprecedented heights as scientists speculated whether the star's dimming was signaling the end. The drastic fluctuations in its brightness left many thinking that the end was imminent, and a supernova visible from Earth would have. One minute and 44 seconds been an extraordinary event in modern history. That year was filled with uncertainty. As data poured in, theories about an inevitable explosion gained traction. But despite the variations in its glow, no explosion ever occurred. Then, the James Webb Space Telescope arrived. A feat of human innovation, the Webb Telescope was designed to look farther than ever before. This breakthrough tool provided astronomers with the ability to observe the universe in ways never thought possible, capturing previously unseen details of the cosmos. Equipped. Two minutes and 18 seconds with a golden mirror over six meters wide, Webb's mission was not only to explore the outermost regions of space but also to answer lingering questions about our own cosmic neighborhood. Betelgeuse quickly became one of its key targets. Could Webb's advanced technology uncover the truth behind the strange behavior of Betelgeuse? Was it possible that the star was hiding something that defied everything we understood about astrophysics? The anticipation for an answer was almost unbearable for scientists. And finally, the first. Two minutes and fifty seconds high-resolution image of Betelgeuse arrived. This image, stunning and revealing, offered a new outlook on the red supergiant. However, it was not what the scientists had anticipated. Webb's infrared imaging revealed a remarkable sight. Far from being a dying, lifeless star, Betelgeuse displayed a vibrant surface, dotted with intense hot spots and bright regions, as though it were brimming with activity. The images also revealed that Betelgeuse was surrounded by an immense cloud of gas and dust, an expulsion of material and 3 minutes and 25 seconds ongoing explosive events on its surface, giving it a constantly shifting and tumultuous appearance. This activity might be responsible for the variations in brightness. Webb's observations uncovered that Betelgeuse's surface behaves like a cosmic battlefield. Vast areas brighten and dim over the course of weeks, an unusual pattern for a star of its size. These violent outbursts, called stellar mass ejections, can expel material in every direction, creating massive clouds of gas around the star. This erratic and extreme behavior has led scientists to, for minutes, develop several theories. Some suggest that this could be a sign that the star is nearing the final phase of its life, while others believe that it might be stabilizing. But one thing is certain, Betelgeuse is acting in a way no one has ever seen from a star of its class. What we are observing in Betelgeuse challenges our understanding of how stars behave. Although we are familiar with the death process of giant stars, the data from Betelgeuse suggests that we might have been underestimating the complexity of this phase. The James Webb. Four minutes and thirty seconds images don't just show the death throes of a star, they also invite reflection on cosmic timescales and our place in the universe. If Betelgeuse were to explode into a supernova, the event would light up our night sky for weeks, acting as a second Sunday thankfully, there is no threat to Earth. Although there is no immediate danger to us, the explosion would dramatically alter our comprehension of the universe. The sheer amount of energy released in such an event would be monumental, 
and astronomers would. Five minutes and one second have a once-in-a-lifetime chance to study the supernova as it happens. For scientists, witnessing Betelgeuse's explosion would be akin to experiencing a rare and spectacular lesson in astrophysics. It would teach us how supernovae spread vital elements like iron and oxygen throughout the cosmos, elements that eventually form planets and even life itself. The James Webb images not only illuminate the life and death cycles of stars, but also have profound implications for the future of space exploration. Observing such grand, 5 minutes and 32 seconds phenomena could unlock secrets about the formation of planetary systems and the dispersal of essential building blocks for life across the universe. In fact, many of the elements found in our own solar system originated from supernovae like the one Betelgeuse might one day produce. Every atom of oxygen we breathe and every atom of carbon in our bodies was forged in the heart of a dying star. In many ways, watching the end of Betelgeuse is like witnessing the end of life itself. As astronomers, it is an 6 minutes and 3 seconds incredible privilege to study these cosmic events. They serve as a reminder of how deeply interconnected we are with the universe, an interconnectedness we are still trying to fully comprehend. Each time a giant star like Betelgeuse dies, it gives rise to new systems, possibly even new planets and forms of life. The James Webb Telescope has provided us with an unprecedented view of Betelgeuse, but this is just the beginning. From exploring distant galaxies to searching for habitable planets, Webb is designed to peer farther. And so on. As the James Webb Space Telescope continues its mission, new revelations about Betelgeuse and other celestial wonders are bound to emerge. The recent high-resolution images have already reshaped our understanding of how massive stars behave, but they also raise more questions than answers. Scientists are now closely monitoring Betelgeuse, analyzing the shifting patterns of gas and dust surrounding it. Some astronomers speculate that these sudden bursts of activity could indicate an unprecedented phase in the star's life cycle, one that challenges everything we thought we knew about stellar evolution. Could Betelgeuse be undergoing a transformation unlike any other? If the star is indeed approaching its final stages, then its inevitable explosion will be one of the most spectacular cosmic events humanity has ever witnessed. A supernova of this magnitude would flood our galaxy with heavy elements, potentially influencing future star systems and even shaping the conditions for new planets to form. However, the timeline remains uncertain. Will this explosion occur within our lifetime, or will Betelgeuse defy predictions and continue its enigmatic fluctuations for centuries to come? Meanwhile, Webb's capabilities extend far beyond Betelgeuse. As the telescope peers deeper into the universe, it is uncovering clues about distant exoplanets, young stars, and ancient galaxies. Scientists are now focusing on planetary systems forming around newly discovered stars, searching for environments that could one day support life. The possibility of finding an exoplanet with atmospheric conditions similar to Earth is closer than ever before. But what if the secrets hidden in the universe are even more profound than we expect? As Webb scans the cosmos, it may detect signs of phenomena we have yet to imagine. Exotic stars, dark matter structures, or perhaps even signals that hint at extraterrestrial intelligence. The story of Betelgeuse is just one chapter in this grand cosmic narrative. As we stand on the precipice of discovery, each new observation from Webb reminds us that our understanding of the universe is still in its infancy. The future of space exploration holds limitless possibilities, and with every passing day, we move one step closer to unraveling the mysteries of the cosmos. What lies beyond the stars? What other wonders await us in the vast expanse of space? One thing is certain, the universe is not done surprising us. A new cosmic mystery unfolds. As astronomers continue to analyze the latest data from the James Webb Space Telescope, they uncovered something even more perplexing about Betelgeuse. The star's surface was not just fluctuating in brightness, it appeared to be undergoing structural changes at an unprecedented scale. Infrared scans revealed massive convective cells shifting unpredictably, releasing bursts of energy never before recorded in a star of this type. Some scientists theorized that Betelgeuse might be undergoing an internal collapse, a process that could precede a supernova. But others proposed a more radical idea. What if Betelgeuse was not dying, but instead entering an unknown phase of stellar evolution? This idea sent ripples through the scientific community. If Betelgeuse was experiencing an undocumented phase, it could mean that our models of stellar death were incomplete. Could it be possible that some red supergiants don't explode in the way we expect? 
Could they transition into something else, something we have never seen before? As weeks passed, astronomers noticed another anomaly. The massive cloud of ejected material surrounding Betelgeuse was behaving strangely. Instead of dispersing into space, it appeared to be coalescing into denser, structured formations. Some areas of the cloud glowed faintly, as though ignited by an unknown force. One team of scientists proposed an astonishing hypothesis. Was Betelgeuse forming a protonebula in real time? If true, this would mark the first time humanity had ever witnessed a supergiant creating a nebula around itself before an explosion. But there was another, even more mind-boggling possibility. What if Betelgeuse was not collapsing, but instead rebirthing itself? A star reborn? If Betelgeuse was undergoing a radical transformation rather than destruction, it could mean the birth of an entirely new stellar object. Some researchers speculated that the star might be shedding its outer layers, cooling into a massive white dwarf or even forming a completely different type of celestial body. If confirmed, this would change everything we know about star life cycles. Could massive stars avoid explosive death by evolving into something else? If so, how many other stars in the universe had followed this path without us ever noticing? Meanwhile, deep space telescopes across the world were redirected toward Betelgeuse, hoping to capture the moment if a supernova were indeed imminent. But as the data rolled in, it became clear, something strange was happening. Betelgeuse was dimming, brightening, and then stabilizing again in unpredictable patterns, cycles unlike anything ever recorded. Then, another unexpected event occurred. A sudden, immense burst of energy was detected, originating from deep within the star. But instead of the telltale gamma-ray burst that signals the onset of a supernova, the energy signature was different. It was controlled, almost rhythmic, like a heartbeat. A signal from the cosmos? The discovery baffled astronomers. Stars were not supposed to behave like this. While pulsations were common in variable stars, the rhythm of Betelgeuse's emissions was too precise, almost like a repeating pattern. It was unlike any natural stellar phenomenon ever observed. Then came the most shocking discovery of all. When astronomers converted the electromagnetic signals into sound waves, the patterns resembled something eerily familiar, structured pulses, reminiscent of signals produced by advanced technology. Was this a natural stellar process beyond human understanding? Or was there something else, something hidden within the heart of Betelgeuse? The James Webb Space Telescope continued its observations, its powerful instruments locked onto the enigmatic star. The scientific community held its breath. Whatever was happening in the depths of Betelgeuse was rewriting the very rules of astrophysics. And somewhere, far beyond Earth, perhaps someone, or something, was watching as well.